The Chicago Bears may have just found their new starting safety in Tayshawn Gibson. What is going on, y'all? Five Sports Talk back at it with another video talking, of course, some NFL here to talk about the Bears who just signed safety Tayshawn Gibson. Before I get into my analysis, if you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. What are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, subscribe right now because I do post a ton of content on the channel, especially Bears, and you're going to want to stay subscribed and turn on your post notifications for that, okay? And follow me also on my social media links down below on the stream. With that being said, let's get into the analysis. Okay, right off the bat, let's start with the contract, and it's another one-year deal. Boy, am I loving these one-year deals that Ryan Pace is handing out. He's like, you get a one-year deal, you get a one-year deal. And you know what? I love it because, like I said, there is no such thing as a bad one-year deal. It's one year. It's low risk, potentially high reward. So you already like that right off the bat. As far as the player himself and Tayshawn Gibson, he just got released by the Houston Texans, okay? And uh, he started 14 games for them. He was a starter for them before he got hurt, had 51 tackles, three interceptions. And that's one thing he does well, intercept the ball. I believe he's got about 23 interceptions in his career, a former pro bowler. So this guy is no slouch. He's no scrub, okay? He is a legitimately good safety. Now, the question becomes, why would the Houston Texans cut him if he is a good safety? Well, he he did get hurt at the end of last season. And two, it's Bill O'Brien. And three, uh, they do save uh, money uh, in salary cap space, I believe about $10 million over the next two years. So that is definitely a reason why they probably did it, okay? I don't care why the Texans did it. The fact is the Bears have him now, and he can slot alongside Eddie Jackson. Now, folks, I think we found our starting safety. Yes, I do believe so, and I had been hammering this point for weeks now, okay, for weeks, because we didn't draft a safety, and we didn't pick up a starting caliber safety in free agency, okay? I know we signed Jordan Lucas, but I looked at him as a backup, okay? And now we've got Tayshawn Gibson, who to me is a legitimate safety option next to Eddie Jackson. He can start at strong safety, though. He can play both positions. But I love it. I love this move for the Chicago Bears uh, because of the fact that we needed a safety. A lot of people are talking about Tony Jefferson. Well, it ended up being Tayshawn Gibson, and I'm so happy about that because, like I said, now you've got two guys on the back end, uh, which... Obviously, you you are very scared of their ball hawking abilities. Clearly, Eddie Jackson's a lot better. I'm not saying that, but the fact is, uh, you're going to expect a lot of interceptions this year, folks. I mean, with that pass rush and now this secondary, whew, it is going to be a misery, a disaster, uh, just a nightmare for opposing quarterbacks uh, dealing with this Bears defense. But yeah, I love this move by the Bears and by Ryan Pace to get Tayshawn Gibson in here. And like I said, I expect him to be our starting safety next to Eddie Jackson. I do believe he'll beat out Deion Bush. Um, and so let's see what happens. But again, I feel pretty good. And now, now, I mean, we got our guys. So I'm feeling really good now about the roster. It's feeling pretty good. The Bears needed a safety. They finally signed one. They needed a receiver, a third receiver. They, they drafted one and they signed one. The only thing left is really hoping that O-line, you know, I'm crossing my fingers here, uh, holds up this season. But yeah, I love this move by the Chicago Bears. Let me know what you guys think about the Bears signing safety, Tayshawn Gibson. Leave a comment down below with your thoughts. As always, thanks for watching.